hi guys in this video we are going to learn how to write algorithm to find sum of first 10 natural numbers and draw flowchart for it here we have to find sum of first 10 natural numbers using algorithm and flowchart here we have to find sum of numbers from 1 to 10 okay first we are going to write algorithm algorithm is a step by step process to solve a problem step 1 Algorithm is always start from start statement. So, first we have to write start statement. Step 2. Here no need to read input values. So, here given no. Here we have to find the first 10 natural numbers. We know that it starts from 1 and end with 10, right? In step 2 here, in step 2 we have to declare n value that is initial number that is one right here we have to declare n is equal to one next to initially sum is equal to zero right so declare sum is equal to zero in step two we have to declare n is equal to one that is initial number n is equal to one and initially sum is equal to zero right so here declare sum is equal to zero step three we have to calculate sum here we have to calculate sum value using formula sum plus n here we have to calculate sum is equal to sum plus n that is sum plus n step 4 we have to calculate n value that is n is equal to n plus 1 initially n value is equal to 1 right next it is increased by 1 right so here we have to add 1 n is equal to n plus 1 step 5 here we have to compare if n value less than or equal to 10 here if n value less than or equal to 10 then we have to repeat the step 3 go to step number 3 we have to go to step number 3 if this condition is false it is directly goes to step number 6 here we have to print some value in step number seven we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement so guys this is the algorithm to find sum of first 10 natural numbers let's see how it works initially n is equal to one sum is equal to zero right in step 3 we have to calculate some value new sum value that is sum is equal to sum plus n that is sum value initially sum is equal to 0 0 plus 1 sum plus n means 0 plus 1 sum value become 1 next we have to calculate n value in step 4 n is equal to n plus 1 that is our n value is 1 1 plus 1 that n value become 2 here n value become 2 some value become 1 if n value n value is 2 right 2 is less than or equal to 10 right 2 is less than 10 so it go to step number 3 again repeat the step sum is equal to sum plus n our sum value is 1 plus n value that is 2 right it become 3 sum value become 3 next two, we have to calculate n value n value is 2 2 plus 1 n plus 1 become 2 plus 1 it become 3 again here n value become 3 some value become 3 it will repeat the step until n value become more than 10 if n value become 11 it will come out of this statement it goes to step number six here it will print the value of sum and in step seven it will stop the algorithm let's see it is step one start statement step two declare n is equal to one sum is equal to zero in step three we have to calculate some value that is sum is equal to sum plus n in step four n is equal to n plus one step five if n value less than or equal to 10 go to step number three else it directly goes to step number six here print some value our output value 
in step 7 we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement next we are going to draw flow chart flow chart flow chart is a graphical representation of solved problem here we are using different geometrical shapes like oval shape parallelogram shape rectangular diamond shape like that flowchart is always start with start statement it is writing within a oval shape within oval shape we have to write start statement next we have to declare the value of n and some right declaration is done within a writing within a rectangular shape within that we have to declare n is equal to 1 sum is equal to 0 initially sum is equal to 0 right so here we have to declare sum is equal to 0 and n is equal to 1 next we have to calculate the sum value right calculation also done within a rectangular shape so within a rectangular shape we have to write sum is equal to sum plus n sum is equal to sum plus n next we have to calculate n value right calculation is done within a rectangular shape within that we have to write n is equal to n plus 1 next step we have to compare right n value n value with 10 right so comparison is done within a diamond shape within diamond shape we have to write if n value less than less than or equal to 10 if n n value less than or equal to 10 we have to repeat this process go to here to calculate sum and n value if n value less than or equal to 10 if this condition is true it directly goes to calculate sum value okay if this condition is false if this condition is false we have to print output value right output value is writing within a parallelogram shape within a parallelogram shape we have to print some value next we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of first and natural numbers it is flowchart is start start from a start statement it is writing within a oval shape here start and stop statement writing within a oval shape output value is writing within a parallelogram shape comparison is done within a diamond shape calculation is declaration and calculation done within a rectangular shape flowchart is start from start statement it is writing within a oval shape next we have to declare n value is equal to 1 and sum is equal to 0 it is writing within a rectangular shape next we have to calculate sum value that is sum is equal to sum plus n calculation is writing within a rectangular shape next we have to calculate n is equal to n plus 1 this is done within a rectangular shape next we have to compare if n value less than or equal to 10 if this condition is true we have to we have to calculate some value again we have to calculate some value so it goes to this process to connect if this condition is false we have to print some value output value is writing within a parallelogram shape within a parallelogram shape we have to write print value print some value finally we have to stop the flowchart using stop statement so guys this is the flowchart to find sum of first and natural numbers okay guys if you like my video please like and subscribe my channel thank you for watching all the best Thank you.